and welcome back to another episode of Wano having another fit. <laughs> Only joking, you're not that lucky. Okay, so what we're doing is we're going to be making the basement now. So if you have just come back in, welcome to Moderns or started watching and decided just to check it out. Welcome to my uh, my little show in the corner here of Modern Skyblock 2 um, with Wayno, that is I. So thought I'd have a little different intro today. So hopefully we get some more customers of watching and then I'll be able to take over the world. I mean, um, <clears throat> it's a lovely day outside, isn't it? Fill this out slowly. So this will be the start of our bees, right? Uh, we actually only got a little bit of platform left, so let's take it out this way. Not too much, because we don't want to run into our void miner, which we actually can't use just as of yet. So if you haven't seen the episode about that, please check it out. If you have, you're all crying with me, because he is such an evil man, or woman, or entity. I don't know what you want to call him, it or entity. So, but I am very much enjoying this pack. It is some ups, it's some downs, it had laughters, some deaths, and you know, children. Um, yeah. So let's go back up. These should be cleared. Add these to the mix. Mix, mix, mix. Okay, time to see how the mana pool is flowing. It's quite far. So let's chuck. So we actually. Damn, so close. So we are quite close to it. Just quickly check to see how our charcoal is running, which is doing really well still. We did actually cook up a heap. No, we actually didn't cook up a heap. Well, the heap's still cooking. Nope, we didn't cook up that much. So. I really miss the Jabba barrels, which had the beast space with them, because you used to beast space all your coal and just run them around the place. You used to make, I think I usually had three to four barrels full of them, and you had them just hooked up there and you know there and over there and on your steam engines and stuff, because that was so amazing. And when I I am going to do a regrowth series, hopefully I will be able to convince um, my son and his cousin. Uh, to play with me. Um, I actually never finished regrowth. I've always gotten up so far right up to the end on like the last one or two chapters and then moved on because they just were so just so long to do. It just yeah. Um, I really miss my save which I actually had. It was humongous. It was automated and it was just absolutely brilliant. I really loved it. Um, I'm actually trying to look for my bee attractor. So yes, I did play it for ages. So and then I stopped. Okay, so I don't know nothing about these bee. It actually requires RF. Wowzers! I did not see that coming. So I will need some power. So let's have a quick look at. Oops, misty. 15. That probably will not get me very far. So, the closest power point <coughs> is straight up. I don't know if that's true or not, but we will see when we get there. Which is actually technically true, but here, there, it needs to go over that way a little. Which. I do not have enough. Um, let's have a look. Oh, actually, I need to go back up. Can I jump out? Nope. So, the connection that we should actually aim for is here, and that's actually off our platform. How about here? Uh, that is right on the edge of the platform, so we will come down there. Um, I will replace the one over here because I do not like holes in my floor, especially when there is a empty drafty space underneath it. So, so the 
should be here. So if I do this, it should indicate where we are. And here. Now let's see how close we have gotten. Oops. Perfect, directly on it. Now unfortunately, I don't have anything to put under it except that. So we go here and here, and then that's our power down. Beautiful. Now, we need seed oil in this. Interesting. I knew it needed some form of liquid, but I didn't think you would actually use seed oil. So it looks like we're probably going to need a tank of seed oil. So we're probably going to need a farmer doing seed oil stuff. Um, uh, I actually need some this will do because these will be changed eventually uh, so I wonder how much seed oil is used in this to attract some bees oh wow oh my god okay so that is pretty much instant and of all the seed oil that has happened so we got wow that is just yeah so we got some really high pristine and ignoble stock. I'm not too sure what that is. Meadows Princess. So yeah, um, I'm wondering if it it's a base on random or it's a full just random, like the first set of base or a complete. Nope, that gave us an infernal drone and a Meadows Princess and two forest drones so this is going to be interesting we need a hell of a lot more seed oil and it doesn't always give us a 100% stock uh, uh, so that kinda sucks so there is I noticed there was some Benny's stuff um, for bees, oh, wait a minute. God, um, I don't even know how it was spelled. Well, that's not going to help, is it? Queen bee, what does that do? I don't even know. Um, because you type in, oh no, actually, you type in bot, wasn't it? And you you got it. Uh, oh, Binnies. Okay, so Binnies gives you the compacting things as well. So it gives you a lot of stuff there. Tile worker. The tile worker creates patterns ceramic tiles. Okay, then no worries. Okay, this is all the B stuff here. Frame housing, hatchery, alvary, lighting, mutator, rain shield, electrical stimulator, alvary trans. Okay, water hive, rock hive, all the type of hives, a scented gear, some of the chocolate frames and that, a nova frame. Is that all the B stuff? I thought there was something to do with a genetic analyzer. Binny's genetics, right here. So isolator, sequencer, polymerizer, uh, in, in your calculator, lab stand, analyzer, incubator. Okay, a gene pool, aculumalizer splicer so this is seems to be like the uh, uh, B genetics one I can't remember what it was called and you had to yeah do all this stuff to get it so this is not going to be fun because I've never really played with bees 
Um, the only way that I used to do bees uh, was um, manually doing it all. So these are all through forestry still, right? So I don't think there's anything. No, so still forestry bees with little twist on it from uh, binnies. So we can go through and find all the bees. There is hundreds of them and you can actually end up mutating these two to get what you want. So you can find out what you want. Frugal, modest with sinister to get sinister cultivated and modest 60% chance. So there's quite a few of them and you need to get your sinister queen, uh, queen. Um, you need to go through and get your alvary stuff. Oh, this is going to be fun. People probably won't watch bees, so I will actually put a title if I'm doing bees in it or not. So, but I will probably have to watch and read up on a few of these because it's been a while. But I know you need to start off with doing your alvary. Because you can do your apiary and bee house, but also you want to do your alivary, which is a multi-block. And then you can change it with, yeah, the fan. You can add the swarmer, a heater to make it hot or cold, the stabilizer, and a sieve. So, yeah. I really miss the other way of doing it, so I think you're... Yeah, you need to start off with the al uh, alvary and then you need to work your way up, I think. So, impregnated sticks, and then you need to go centered paneling, which you probably could make. Same with all this. But it's rather expensive, actually, to get through this. So, you probably could just make a bee house, <laughs> uh, which is from your alvary. So, you need to start with this. So, we need to start from all the way back there. Because we need to get to the, um, crap, what do you call it? Wax, that's all I can remember the name of it. This stuff here, refractory wax, which you need to get it from a molten comb, which is from Smoldering Inferno, Hateful, Spiteful, Dun uh, Dante, or Pyro. So let's have a look. So the highest one that you want to go is Spiteful. You get Spiteful is Inferno in Hateful, Hateful is Eldridge. So you can actually get it, you just need to take it. And you can actually do Incubation, so you can do it yourself. So there is a lot of work that needs to be done. Wow, this is, this is going to be very hectic. So if you do not wish, want to, wish to want, if you don't wish to, no, fuck, ah, uh, sorry. Um, if you don't want to watch, me do bees. I will name it as bees. Um, after that, I will not. Um, and yeah, I will. I will be naming the videos bees, and then what happened? Because I know a lot of people don't like to watch bee crap. So yeah, and not quite a full stack. So yeah, I don't need that many. I think. Um, that's only giving me two blocks, two blocks to one, so, and that will give us nine, uh, oops, and if I break it down, oh no, I don't want to use, okay, so, Thundercaller, I don't even know what that is, uh, we got the Sash, which is good, Nimbus, I don't even know what that is. Nimbus to me is a flying cloud. Another star caller, Starfield Creator. Elven Spreader, which I actually will need. Spark Tinker. I wonder what that is. Slime in a bottle. Interesting. Ring of Far Reach, so that's probably sucks your rings are uh, things, magnetic. Rod of Bitfrost. Gaia Pylon, uh, Great Fairy Ring, I think that restores your mana. And there's your bucket, there's a nugget, there's a tripwire, mana lenses, 
Don't really care about them. The drum of Gathering. Interesting. Frugal Tiara. That allows me to fly, but I need some Gaia Spirit stuff. Elementium Sword, Shovel, and Shears. This is what I really want to get into because this is actually the higher end stuff. I know it's the green stuff I actually need, sorry. But a pixel will pop up. And just some other stuff, so... I guess you can crush it, melt it. I um, wonder what the crush stuff does. Which is through Jar Abuka, whatever the hell that is. So, okay, so you can't really... Uh, oh, actually, sorry, used. Um, so, yeah, there's not much else you can actually use. You probably could do... Well, there's 14 pages, so you can make your own... Or make weapons and stuff with it, by the look of it. Yep. Okay, so I don't really need that much. So I'm just going to turn this on and... I actually need diamonds too, don't I? Damn it. Hmm. We need lots of seeds. We need a lot of seeds. So... Flax seeds are brilliant. Just leave one in there. But, unfortunately, we don't have enough. We haven't been producing enough, so probably next episode I'll build a farmer and then I'll just deck the farm out and that will be for food and all that. I have stopped on refined storage due to needing a lot of um, uh, quartz enriched iron, which I'm trying to keep up with, but it is just way too much. So. I am just stockpiling at the moment and when this gets low I will go stockpile some more and as you can see the um, gems and all that are starting to back up so I will need to go through and make um, either the upgrades or a void which I probably just void it all because I don't really need that much of everything I mean I think it holds 2000 so yeah 2048 right there so and I'll just void the rest it doesn't need that much but I have actually got some decent amount of ah yeah that's not gonna work I really need to get this automated so hmm but yeah I need actual actually I know what I'll do the bees can be kept in here haha <laughs> so Oops. Get off the platform and jump a bit. And there we go. So, we have started the bees, but haven't actually gotten anywhere th where with them because it will be a pain. I will try and convert the rest of these, but I need diamonds. So, I got five diamonds. No, I don't. Now I do. Okay, so we got four diamonds, and I think you only need to throw one of them in. Yeah, one to one ratio. Um, I don't think you need actually many diamonds for anything. Interesting, Mana Blaster. Cool. Doesn't actually tell you what it is. Rod of Plentiful Mantle. That actually creates dirt from memory, or stone, either one. I can't make that, so living wood avatar. I wonder what that is. And then you can actually convert it into the rune of lust or throw it. So, yeah. Um, so you throw it and you get this, and then you have the uses for this is making a world seed. I have no clue what that is. I think that teleports you back. And then you got that. You got the Gaia Mana Spreader, which is the upgraded, which we don't need just as yet. We are Helloway, Rod of Unstable, uh, Luminider, Shape, uh, Shard of Lap Utah, uh, Rod of. Yeah, a lot of this stuff I will probably have to go through, but we don't really need much in this, so it's probably just 
we grab it and just in case four should be enough so we'll put this one back I'm just trying to make sure because when I open it I want it to be open and I should be able to get quite a few things out of it so I really should just knock these two out and yeah set up my own room for automation that because for the for the automation this won't be in here for the room of automation it will be all thermal stuff so and back to it I need to get all the crafting up and running so I can quickly make all the stuff so I want to be able to just hit go and then wait a couple of minutes and everything will show in my yeah, up in there ready to be used that's what I want um, the only thing I probably won't automate is the making of resources just as yet um, because it yeah I don't want to overly waste the te uh, tertiary stuff because it is rather annoying um, I probably could drop down to the one before it but I don't want to just in case yet because you don't get as much in a pack I mean I, I am duplicating my ores and stuff now so I probably could I will think about it and see if it's worth it so because technically this is really expensive I mean it, it is but this is just really easy to make you um, get quite a few out of the yield this one gives you 450 so you times that three times of this but I think it's not worth the actual timing of getting the palace crystals every time so unless you have plenty of power without you know this I still actually haven't made this so um, yeah let's see see this is full now that is just chockers so and we're actually backing up in this now so let's and this has got a stack limit of one so but we could easily make a third generator which will hopefully run everything without this and this will only kick in when we do the empowered crystals until we get this up and running to finish those 20 blocks so we will see how that goes ah what a pain it really is a pain let's see if I can drop some more of these in so I did up to 13 so I really should make more it will use more coal but it will produce more coal so I think I might get I wonder if that actually is affecting these doesn't look like it, it is because that should be ah it's turning it on and off see ah so I found a little little buggy wuggy hmm So that will be affecting three of these. So I'm going to have to push this back. Okay. So. Uh, I must put my chisel back. I did. probably didn't need to go excessive with making uh, getting all these but better safe than sorry this wand is very dangerous I will admit to that I have accidentally double clicked and put the, the row here and then it built another row here and it filled up everything eh, or not on this map on another one and I was like how could I do that it took me ages to break everything. So you have to be very careful with it. So and do I have the exchanger on me? I do. So we could just go uh, okay like this, then like this. 
and done and then it changes it out easily so what I need to do is I need to move this actually back to a diagonal position um, I think I might do might move it all so I'll pick this up and I'll just fix it when I get there and I'll show you what I will do so don't care if I'm wasting mana so I probably actually could have kept all that there. Mm, we'll work it out in a tick. So, one, two, yeah, see, I'll have to move this. And so we completely move this. Three by three here. We need some more dirt. No dirt in there, and there it is there. So this will be the three by three dirt there, right? And then you usually have another one here. Pair this like that, like this, and then you have another one here. I will need more dirt, but you get the idea right on the edge of that mana pool so that's good and here and I'll jump down and I'll pick up all the extra blocks and it's good because that thing's telling me where they all are so okay so right now it's not working but you do this and then you put the pressure plate here um, um, I don't think this actually works on an angle Let's, yeah see where if I put it here uh, okay it's not affecting it this mustn't pass so it doesn't look like it's passing it down here but if I do this and then this oh that's not affecting it oh no it would be affecting it of course see so like that um, so that will actually tell it. I need a a a a a lamp. It shouldn't be too hard to make if we have some glowstone. We got 40 glowstone. Uh, what was it? We at like 38, 30 something. Uh, yeah. So we didn't. We hardly any made any glowstone. It's not worth our time doing that. Alas, which is kind of sad because, yeah, it's free glowstone. Oh, really? I just did that. There is our lamp, and I will go um, more quartz in there. Grab this, oh, and you can do one. 
stay this. Uh, I'll put this glowstone away, and I need to put some of you away. Okay, so the lamp will actually show us actually doesn't turn on unless you've got a direct link to it but as you can see the light actually doesn't come on from the angles but if we put this here see how it turns on so when it was sitting next to them here and here it was affecting it but if we put a redstone torch or uh, this down here watch this see it turns it off even when it's a straight down so it affects it now the way to fix it is we'll um, come down one Oops. I really need to find some boots that start so I don't hurt myself when I fall is oh, I actually came all the way back up for nothing ah oh, this is sad Okay, so we'll do one here, one here, one here, and here. This will, just in case we need to modify something up there, we have the blocks. So, and we go here, we step on the block, but it shouldn't actually, oh it does! We need to go down a second time. So, Hmm. This is going to be interesting. What if I did this? Because we don't have any red. Uh, cabling for this do we to send red uh, um, redstone signal wow I guess we could do a um, Xnet setup on it. Ah, oh, I forgot to put another block down. <sighs> well, it is wrapping up point in time anyway, so yeah, I will have to work this out. And yeah, so this is the end of the episode, and I will see you in the next one. Later's.